Good morning everybody and welcome to my channel. My name is Elizabeth. If you are brand new to my channel, welcome. If you are family already, then grab your favorite chair, grab your coffee, or whatever it is that you enjoy, and I've got a Dollar Tree for all, all of you. Um, first of all, I have to say, it is so, so hot here in New York State. It's 97 degrees right now, um, and it's early. The humidity is killer. Um, they're saying another 10 days worth of this. So for everybody that's out there that's getting this kind of weather, please, please, please make sure you're hydrating yourself. Make sure you're checking on family and friends that may not have central air and just do the best you can to try to stay cool. Out here in New York State, we have all kinds of air quality uh, warnings up. They're encouraging people as much as possible to take public transportation because of the heat. And because I'm in the valley, the humidity is so thick it's like a it's like a fog it's really really weird i tried to take some pictures but they really it's really hard to tell on my camera um to get the idea of what i'm actually referring to um so it's just absolutely crazy so please everybody just be safe um watch for the older people um even younger people just everybody that you know just check on them a phone call hey everything okay that's, you know, it's just important. Okay, so I have a Dollar Tree haul for all of you. And I'm just going to start with some food stuff and then continue to what I call the good stuff. Okay, not that food's not good, but you guys know what I mean. Stuffed olives, <laughs> love them. I like to make a lot of salads during the summertime because obviously we don't want the ovens going because it's just too darn hot. This is a five ounce of the Breckenridge Farms stuffed olives. Sometimes I just eat these all by themselves. Other times I just use them in different types of salads. So this is a repeat for me. These are very good. Um, again, it's five ounces, which is 140 grams. There is a total of 2.5 grams of fat for this entire jar. Um, again, I use these for making different kinds of salads and that in the summertime because it's just too darn hot to be putting that oven on. Healthy Choice Soup. This is chicken noodle, it's 90 calories. What I loved about this is it's in the microwavable container. So basically you pop this lid off, this plastic lid, you pop it off, Let's see if I can. Then you have the top right here that you pull the tab and then you pop the lid right back on, pop it in the microwave and you're good to go. Uh, this is 14 ounces of the Healthy Choice Chicken Noodle. I like to have these around every now and then because sometimes you just want some soup, obviously not right now, um, but you want some soup and you don't want to go through the hassle of just doing the whole stove thing. The expiration date on this package is December 5th of 2018, so I have plenty of time to get me into those fall months, which I'm going to be wanting soup at that point. This is another repeat purchase. I did run into more of the um, emerald almonds, not almonds, excuse me, the cashews. They have the pumpkin spice, which I'm not a fan of, and then they have the regular whole cashews. These are so good, and they're so fresh. I bought so many of these and just given them out to people. You get five ounces, so that's a, for a dollar. Amazing bargain. You just cannot go wrong. This is a brand name, been out for a very long time, so that is a repeat buy as well. Uh, the Golden Pack cereals. So what you're getting is one, two, three, four, five, five of what I call basically the Dollar Tree brand. Um, so you have Cocoa Balls, Fruit Rings, Sugar Flakes, Apple Bits, and Crunchy King. This is basically just their version, you know, Captain Crunch, um, Apple Jacks, Sugar Frosted Flakes, Fruit Loops, and Cocoa Puffs. Basically, that's what it is. They're all in the little small individual boxes that you'll see like in diners and cafes. What I like about these is they're small, they're compact. Throw a couple, you can even throw them in your purse if you have a purse that's big like mine. Of course, my dad used to call my purse a feeder bag because it was so big, and it is. I carry a big purse. Um, but those are nice for any time. You know, even if you're out and about and you need a snack because you're just feeling like you need something, it's not just for kids, really, it's, it's awesome. This I've never purchased before. This is the Annie's Homegrown Creamy Tomato and Bunny Pasta Soup. These are in a .17 ounce, and these are like in a, um, I don't wanna say cardboard, but it almost is. You guys know what I'm talking about, where you get like your broths and your stocks. So this is a 17 fluid ounce organic creamy tomato and bunny pasta soup. I'm curious to see what this tastes like. I've never tried it before. I'm very interested. 
Um, it does say it's made with no artificial flavors, colors, or preservatives, no high fructose corn syrup, half a cup of vegetable per serving. Again, this is the organic creamy tomato. So I did purchase two. I've seen people haul these on different channels and they have nothing but good things to say about them. So I'm curious to check them out. Okay, so these are some purchases now that are new to me and a couple repeats. I did come across some more of the Monster High Minis. Now, if you follow me on Instagram, you saw that there was an entire case sitting on a shelf. Do I have to say more? So I do have a couple more. Um, I'm not going to open them in this video. If you guys are interested in seeing me open some more, please let me know. Um, for the most part, people know what they look like. So I'm just going to continue moving on through the video at this point. <coughs> Excuse me. After I have a coughing fit, which I'm not going to edit because this is just the way I roll. <laughs> okay. Tic Tacs. We all know what Tic Tacs are. They've been around forever. This package is good until October of 2018, but what got my eye, and you guys know, I love little baby things in certain things. I like the miniatures, the trial size, whatever you'd like to call them. So this package I'm ripping open right now, you get three of these little itty baby containers. I don't know how many's in each container, but if I had to guess, probably 25 so you get three of these little itty and you notice how my voice changes when I go to little baby stuff uh, what can I say I'm another year older as of two days ago and I'm just getting even more wacky so yes look at these little babies they're so cute so you get three in that package I thought it was just super cute obviously an impulse buy um, but they were so cute and you know what toss a couple in your package in your glove box in the car oy vey they're everywhere the new Colgate toothbrushes. Um, this is in the soft. This is in blue. No, blue is not my color. It's a pretty color, just not my color, but there was no pinks or purples um, or anything like that, but I did want to get one. So these are made by Colgate. What's cool about these is you can see on the front of the package here, this toothbrush folds down into this container. Then you close it up and I'm just going to flip over the side here so you can get a better idea of what I'm speaking of. So what happens is right here, when you cl end up closing the toothbrush, it looks like this. So it's just a little piece like this long. So perfect for traveling. So perfect for tossing in your purse, um, your tote bag, if you're tra for anything. Um, sometimes I just like to brush my teeth in the middle of the day while I'm out. So I have something like that in my purse. I usually buy the little Colgate double packages that they sell at Dollar Tree. That's just even better because that's a better quality toothbrush and the fact that you can fold it up without having to get, you know, slime and toothpaste all over the place. I just thought it was pretty cool. Okay, now I purchased some of these new bath bombs I found. I'm not a bath bomb person, but that's just me. Um, but I purchased them because I know how many people do love the bath bombs and these were super, super cute. I hadn't seen any of these before, but that's just me. Okay. I purchased, um, they all basically just say bath bomb. This one says donut stress. It's in the shape of a donut. I know there's some glare here. I'm doing the best I can. There's so much light coming through. I have most of my blinds closed, but you can still just trying to stay cool. But this one is in the shape of a donut, and then it's got sprinkles here. These are big. I mean, these are big. This is over three inches across, so this is a good size. You could probably plunk somebody in the head with this, and it would actually hurt. I did get two of the donuts because I thought they were cute. The next style I found was this cute little unicorn, and it says, I believe in magic. Now, none of these say they have a specific scent. Wait, I totally just lied. My bad, my bad. Rewind. Okay, this one says do not stress and then on the back it says do not stress donut scented bath bomb so it's donut scented it smells kind of like vanilla i don't know what do you think <laughs> i wonder if you guys still actually do this it smells like vanilla to me okay so the next one is this unicorn can oh i don't know if you guys can see it but you can see all the little speckles of color in there and this bag doesn't help, but there's the shape of the unicorn. And it's got all these color speckles in there. This one says, I believe in magic. Vanilla sprinkle scented. 
Now this one does smell a lot more vanilla than the donut. Next, this one says very, very pink and it's a pink ball with this dark pink glitter and it says very, very pink wild berry. I can smell some berry through the package, absolutely. Next, tropical soak and this one is coconut eucalyptus. Mm. I can smell coconut and this one is in, it's like a shell and it's, it's a round ball, but the outside is like a shell, the outside of a shell. And it's got purples and aqua blues and teal, really cool. Last but not least, I think this is my favorite. You guys are gonna say, no way, she just showed a unicorn and this is her favorite? I'm really a mermaid. And she is so pretty. I'm gonna fold it in so you can get a little bit better idea of the shape of her, there she is. She's done in a very pretty light blue and purple, and she is coconut scented. It's hard to tell in the packages. I mean, I'm getting little whiffs. I would have to say, you know, the vanilla one, I think the vanilla is probably, and the berry are the strongest out of them all. So that was one, two, three, four, five different versions I found. I have no idea if there's more out there. These were the only ones that were out there on the shelves. Okay, Glow Pops. I hauled these a while back. These are the um, Charms Lemonade Stand, which is lemon, raspberry lemonade, regular lemonade, and strawberry lemonade. Oh, God, these are so good. For those of you that like Glow Pops, for those of you that like lemonade, oh, my God. These are good until March of 2020, so you've got plenty of time to keep these around. These are only gonna be around during the summer months. Um, I did inquire about it, and she, the she, when I say the girl at the Dollar Tree said, that's just gonna be a summer thing. Once they're gone, they're gone. So I grabbed a couple more because I do enjoy them, and some people that I hang with enjoy them as well. Okay, pens, <clears throat> excuse me. This is an eight pack of the Incorporated Clip Clicks. I wasn't really sure if I was going to like these or not because I have pens that I use the same kind all the time. I just like the way they write. I know they're consistent and I enjoy them. But one of the girls at the Dollar Tree that I was at was writing in this pink pen and she borrowed it to me because I needed to sign something and it wrote so well because I asked her, I said, oh my God, where'd you get this pen? She goes right there on the shelf. So I purchased it um her name is Brittany hey Brittany <laughs> um I'm gonna give these a try and see how they work out so you're basically getting eight colors you get two pink two orange two green and two blue they are clickables they write in these colors and this was such a vibrant hot pink that yes I went back to the shelf and grabbed the pens because I thought it was really cool DV studio has more stationery back out if I remember right and I could be wrong they had a version just like this or one close to it last year. This is the Crown Jewels, which they make beautiful notebooks. I got to hand it to them. They make beautiful notebooks. This is the DB Studios Pocket Notepad. I love the metallic on this pad. It is so cute. I'm going to open it up for you so you can see exactly what I'm referring to. So this is basically just a pocket notepad. And what that means is it's pocket there's what the outside looks like. The top flips up, but there's a magnet in here. So when you close this back down, can you, I don't know if you can hear that click with all my air conditioners running, but there's a click because it's magnetic that holds the pad in place. When you open the pad up, this is the design on the inside. I'm not sure because of that glare, but every single sheet is the same. I love these. I have one of these in my purse as we speak. Not this design, but one of their older versions. It's almost out of paper. And I slip it in the side pocket. I pull it out and use it all the time. The other thing I like about this is it's a sturdy pad. Um, it's not hard, but it's sturdy. So when I'm writing on it, it's great to write on. So there was this version. And then there was this version. Now, let me see if they tell you how many sheets are in here. They do not. If I had to guess, there's at least 100 sheets in here, if not more. 
Here's the front of this version that I found and the back side. Okay, last but not least, now I have no small children around, but everybody's hauling these and I'd never really looked for them before and then I saw one, I found it and I went, oh, that's cute. And me being me, of course I had to get some. I didn't get all of them, I just got a couple. These are the new squishies. This is the kitty cat. That's the kitty. So basically you just, my God, you squeeze them and they just pop right back. Too bad we weren't all like that, right? You just squeeze them and you pop them right back. They are so soft. So they had the kitty, they had all of them. They had the sloth, they had the unicorn, they had the kitty laying down. There was really no reason for me to grab all those, but you know, you know, oh yes girl, she did. You know she's gotta have the unicorns, right? Of course, I had to have two. And there they are. They're so cute. There you've got purple and pink and red and yellow. They're so adorable. They really are sweet and precious. They're not huge. This guy's a little over four inches long. So they're not gargantuan. You can see them here in my hand. But you just squish them. You go like this and then the book, they come right back. Ta-da! <laughs> okay, everybody. I hope you enjoyed my video this morning. I wish everybody, please, please be safe out in this insane, crazy weather. I hope you all have a wonderful day. Thank you so much for tuning in. I'm going to be doing some more videos, and I'm also going to be doing a friend mail and birthday haul. I received so much mail. I'm still going through it. I'm going to be doing a thank you video to all of you. I haven't forgotten. So until next time, have a wonderful day, everybody, and please be safe. Any questions or comments down below? Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Have a wonderful day, everybody. Bye for now.